Let's uh, get you the latest pictures that are coming in from Madhya Pradesh uh, where Tamil protesters are holding a sit-in dharna and in fact have begun their march as Sri Lankan President Rajapaksha is visiting the state today for the inauguration of one of the Buddhist centers in Sanchi which falls on the constituency of Sushma Swaraj. Remember BJP leader Sushma Swaraj had tried to distance herself uh, from the Rajapaksha Rao saying that Sri Lankan president was invited by the central government, not by the BJP, but Waiko there taking on both the BJP and the Congress, as well as the UPA government, uh, saying they are hurting the sentiments of Tamil people. Premada now joins us with the latest. Premada, what really is the plan uh, as far as these Tamil protesters go, who are being led by Waiko, the protests that are taking place? Um, at the border of Maharashtra and Madhya Pradesh where they were stopped as well as in Deputy High Commission in Chennai where we saw effigies being burnt of Rajapaksha. Well, there are so many print parties here who are conducting protests across Tamil Nadu. Just a while ago, a protest happened in Coimbatore as well. We just saw more than 100 BCK leaders, the BCK members getting arrested for trying to go near the Sri Lankan Deputy High Commissioner's office to stage a protest here. As far as Vaiko is concerned, my person in the NDNK are saying that they will continue to protest, they will keep shouting slogans. Of course, they will not be allowed to move beyond the border, but they are going to flash the road and they are going to continue. Well, I'll just let you hold your thought. Let's get a ground check now. Joining us from the scene of protest is our correspondent Ankit Tyalki. Ankit, uh, we are seeing these pictures right now in which these protesters are being huddled into a bus. Massive security deployment there. Take us to what exactly is happening. As of now, Waiko said that he will uh, move towards Sanchi and that the police wants to attack them or arrest them. He's ready for that. You can see uh, right now uh, 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 this part in which Waiko is forcing arrest. He is standing, he is standing there uh, and uh, he has been formally arrested uh, by the police. Uh, they, uh, he's saying that uh, uh, they, they wanted uh, they wanted to move towards Sanchi, but uh, there was a massive deployment of the police. The police had made sure that uh, uh, he doesn't cross this barricade here at Bhatt Shisholi. When, the, when they started marching towards it, Waiko along with his supporters uh, have been arrested uh, uh, here and they are being huddled into buses and they will be taken to two com uh, temporary confinement. Ankit, I'm going to hold your thought. We just come back to you. I believe Waiko is currently speaking to the media. Oh, Let's listen to it. Are getting arrested. Yes. What will be next step after that? I will next step, I will announce after 4 o'clock. The, the next step, I have clearly stated, three, three decisions I have announced. What more you want? We will embargo the Prime Minister's residence. We will go to every state capital. We will distribute the vernacular language version of the genocide of Elam Tamils and hearts bleed. And we have given a stand warning to the union government not to further support, not to invite this bloodthirsty monster again. This is the thing I have given. Why did I